Ladies and gentlemen, the horses are on the track and pretty to the post this afternoon's first race. A claiming pace, racing one mile. Number one is exciting finale. On the divot by Phil Cunningham of Marysville. Two is Candor Jack, owned by Chris McGuire Franklin for Mike Wilder. Number three, Shuncrest Style, owned by Chancey Love of Proctorsville for Eric Lenford. Four is Raven Colt, owned by David Overholzer, Bill Fountain with Jim Shelton. Five is Sparkling Special, owned by David Cooper of Sabina with Herbie Brown. Number six, Pendle Messenger, owned by David Linden of Franklin for Terry Groves. Seven is Country George, owned by Keith Richardson of Westchester. Brad Hanner is aboard. Number eight, Eddie's Alibi, owned by Ron Barker of Chillicothe. Trent Tharps in the bike. Number nine, the son of BV, owned by Dave Ehrenberg, the second of Grove City. Sean Mayhew in the sulky. The gate swings into the back stretch, and there they go. And they're off, and it's the four Raven Cold and the one exciting finale. These two away together. From the inside, it's Cantor Jack dropping in a fourth, Shuncrest style. Angling in five comes Sparkling Special to the outside of sixth. It's Pendle Messenger. Three wide seventh, Country George between horses eight. That is Alibi, the son of BV, grabs the early back seat ninth as they move to the upper turn, exciting finale. Put on the front end, takes a lead by two. Raven Cole to the inside, gives it up for the cover second. Catter Jack of the inside is pacing third, fourth is Shuncrest style. They reach the first quarter mile marker in 30 seconds flat. Racing fifth, and now to the outside, Sparkling is special. With the cover sixth is Pendle Messenger. Saving ground seventh, Country George. To the outside, off the back end comes the son of BV. Now the trailer is Eddie's alibi. As they race into the clubhouse turn, exciting finale, nine to two shot. Showing the way here, here comes Catter Jack to the outside, moving first up second. In the pocket and third, Raven Colt gapping. Cover fourth, it's sparkling. Special there at the half in 101 and a three fifths. Moderate pace as they move off the turn and down the back stretch. Out of the outside, Canterjack looking the leader in the eye. Exciting finale. Digging in here for the battle as they race down the back stretch. Raven Colt came to the outside, but it's gapping cover badly. Third, inside of fourth, the Shellcrest style. Outside, Sparkling Special couldn't keep up with cover. Fifth, in the pocket, sixth is Country George. Outside and seventh, Pendle Messenger. Three quarters, 129 and four. And it's Canterjack. Back on top here, Canterjack. Odds on favored by three. Exciting finale on the inside is second. Raven Colt inching up on the outside. Shellcrest style is closing ground and saving ground to the inside fourth. Less than an eighth of a mile to go. And down the stretch they come. Canter Jack with the lead. Exciting finale coming right back to him. Shellcrest style down to the inside. Into deep stretch. An exciting finale getting back up here. Exciting finale in front. Track side, ladies and gentlemen, the official winner of the first coming back in the stretch drive, the one exciting finale. Nine-year-old son of Nia Tross from Queen Margie, owned, trained, and nicely handled by Phil Cunningham of Marysville, Ohio. Second season's victory for the nine-year-old pacer, the mile in two minutes, one fifth. Complete order of finish from the top down, number one. Exciting finale, the winner. Canterjack, two. Shellcrest style, three. Raven Colt, four. Sparkling Special, 6. Pendle Messenger, 8. Country George, 5. And Izalabai, 7. The Summer BV, 9.